We have six artists and six canvases. You will each be designing and painting your own house. Whoa. And obviously it wouldn't be a ZHC video if it didn't come with a big prize, so I'm gonna pair you guys up with a subscriber. If you win, both you and your subscriber will have your house paid for or your rent paid for. You have four hours, only the best one will win. This drum will determine what kind of house you're painting. Close your eyes, pick one. All right, you're painting a tree house. Yeah. You pick the green one, which means you have to do a modern house. All right, you got a modern house. You also got a modern house. Oh, you're also doing a tree house. You have three hours and 50 minutes left. I got my own set of paintbrushes. Yeah. Now, I'm gonna start by sketching out the structure to my modern house. So I have a couple options to choose from. Zach, which one of these do you think I'm going to win? Why don't you make a Minecraft modern house? If Zach suggests me doing that, then I'm, I'm gonna do it. What are you working on? I'm gonna go ahead and do like some water with like some boats going through with some tree houses crossing. Oh, also bonus points if you add any creative concepts. I really like creative modern designs. I am going to make a very beautiful Minecraft house. Are you gonna include your character, Mr. Bacon? Definitely Mr. Bacon's going on the roof. I'm working on a ZHC teen themed modern house. It will incorporate everyone's colors. What's gonna make yours stand out from everyone else's? I think maybe the design is gonna be a little different. I want it to be very like whimsical and fantasy, so I want it to be a little bit more magical in that way. For mine, I'm trying to keep it very modern, obviously, but also incorporate a lot of things from nature. Like I'm going to try and possibly put like a garden in here Ooh. and make it very eco-friendly. Looks like everyone's good to go. We'll have some fun challenges coming soon. Oh, also in just a second, you're gonna meet your subscribers. Yay! Yay! Everyone, it is time for a challenge. Since this is all about houses and buildings, how tall do you think the world's largest building is? Whoever gets closest will have an advantage. Just to make this simple, let's just put it in meters. Go Jazz, how many meters? 547. 5,000. <laughs> 1,200 meters. 700 meters? 700? 1,100. The answer was 828 meters. Izzy, you're the closest. Here's what's gonna happen. There are two things you're gonna do. You're gonna choose one person and force them to use their left hand, and you're gonna choose another person and force them to use only one color. Okay, Mackenzie, left hand. Oh. <laughs> Michelle, is your house gonna be pink? Yes. You have to use one color. Michelle, for right now, you can only use one color. Hi. Hey, what's up? What's your name? Uh, Dominic. And you say you're from uh, Germany. Cool. We're doing a craft video right now. Whoever paints the best house wins rent. Because I picked you, and <laughs> if I win, you get your rent paid for as well. I'm Jason I'm from the Philippines. You're my partner for this challenge. My treehouse wins. That means that you and I both have the opportunity to get our rent paid for. Hi, I'm Anna. We are in a ZHC craft video right now. We are designing houses. And I know that you don't have rent paid for. So if I win, Zach will buy you $1,000 worth of art supplies. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> Hello. My name is Merlin. Hi Merlin, I love that. I'm Isabella. Where are you from? Germany, from Hamburg. You are chosen to be my partner for the challenge. If I win, we're both going to get our rent paid for. Oh, that's amazing. Do you have any advice, any ideas for me to add anything to my treehouse? Oh, actually, yes. My sister is a really good rock. You could add a picture from her inside of your tree. Okay, I love that. All right. I hope you win. I, I hope so, too. Hi. I am Siobhan. Nice to meet you, Siobhan. I'm Mackenzie. Right now, you're working on some house painting. Did you have any advice for me? Things and loves TVs. You have the most wins, right? So yeah, I do. <laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna try and win, okay? Since we're working on houses, we have some more fun facts about houses. Whoever gets the closest gets to mess around with the other competitors a bit. You guys are gonna guess what the square footage of the world's largest house is, according to Google. How many square feet do you think the world's largest house is? 100,000? 110,000? I'll take 120,000. 90,000? 
212,000. The answer is a 27 story mansion in India, 400,000 square feet. So Jazz gets to choose two contestants. One has to paint with their big toe, the other one has to paint with their finger. Izzy, since you look like you have a lot down so far, I'm gonna go ahead and have you paint with your big toe. <laughs> and Jade, go ahead and have you, you paint not. with your finger. <gasps> All right, Jake, lift up one finger. That is the only finger you can use. And Izzy, you have to paint with your big toe. All right, good luck. So there's a lot of stuff to keep up with right now. Michelle can only paint with one color. Jake has to paint with his finger. Izzy is painting with her toe and Mackenzie has to paint with her left hand. Things are getting pretty crazier, but we have something else that's gonna change everything. Come with me to the back. Rules are really simple. If you can bounce the ping pong ball into the cup, you get to steal any one of your competitors and add them to your roster for an hour. Oh! Oh! All right! Oh! 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 All right, Mackenzie, choose any one of your competitors and add them to your team for one hour. Jazz it is! All right, Jazz, you're on Mackenzie's team for the next hour. And just to make sure you're being a good sport, you gotta give it your all on Mackenzie's piece. No sabotaging, you have to help her. So right now, each artist is dealing with an obstacle. I'll give you guys a chance to play me in rock, paper, scissors. If you win, you get to go back to just painting. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Dang it. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. No. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Izzy, you can go back to painting with your hand. Jazz, you're not so lucky. You need to do this for an hour. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> Looks like Izzy gets to paint normally. Everyone else. Ah. You're screwed. Yeah, what Mackenzie said. <laughs> You're gonna roll the die. If you call it correctly, you get to put your hand in paint and put it on someone else's painting. Three. Oh. I'll choose five. Oh. Put your hand in this and put it on someone's painting. I yes. might just have to flop no, no, it. No, no, no. Two. Five. Three. Wait, a lot of fives. It looks like the rest of you are safe for now. So I am thinking of a number from one through five. Five. Two. Two. Four. Five. The number was five, which means Michelle and Izzy, you both have to count to a thousand. Right now? Yeah, right now. <laughs> Mackenzie, it's been one hour, which means you can switch to your right hand. However, this is a pair of handcuffs. As a team, you guys will decide who we should handcuff together. Guys, meet in the middle and discuss. Still yeah. goes. Oh, it's Wait. Izzy and Mackenzie. What? All right, Izzy and Mackenzie, how's this gonna work? I just got my left hand back. My All right, right well, back. you have to scoot in then. What? No, 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 no. Th All right, why that's would it. you do this? Until the end of the challenge. You guys still have another hour, 40 minutes. <laughs> So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna roll a die. You get to call odds or evens. If you call it correctly, you can take one paint marker and draw a streak through someone's painting. Odd or even? Uh, even. Ooh, Mackenzie, draw one streak through anyone's painting. Okay, sorry, Izzy. Oh no! Oh! Mackenzie! <laughs> My hand hurt, buddy! Izzy, time for you to roll it. Odds. What is it? Three. Izzy, now you get to grab the marker and do a streak through someone's painting. I'm gonna be nice. Thank you. Well, that wasn't too bad. Odd or even? Even. Oh, oh no. Two. <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh, the marker's getting Whoa. dragged in the water. Hi, Jess. Go for it. Odd. Ah, uh, you don't get it to ruin anyone's. You all have 30 minutes left. Everyone, hands in the air. Hold up your paintings. Let's take a look. Tell me a little bit about your painting. So we were told to paint a house. And this is a very unique house. It was a tree house. And I decided that my people were gonna live inside the boat. So that's the tree house? Yeah, that is my tree house. Because it's made out of tree. 
Michelle's not here right now, but she has a pink house and she has Mr. Bacon on it. She has a Minecraft sea turtle and she tried to make a modern Minecraft house, which is also pink. It's very nice. It's a house on top of Scrunchy's head. It was themed in our colors. A little unfinished. We have a door. We have some windows. She had a really nice Scrunchy. I think the house is small and cute. I like how colorful it is. Very nice, Jake. So I wanted to make a free community. I wanted to make it really colorful. This is the planetarium. My subscriber Melvin said that he wanted me to include a drawing by his sister and his sister drew an octopus so I wanted to add an octopus mm -hmm. on one of the signs. This is like a sushi bar. Very nice. I like how there's a lot of buildings over here. There's a lot of detail. There's like a nice old rustic look that came with the tree house. Very, very beautiful piece. So I have my modern home. It has a fish tank which the poop from the fish tank goes and provides fertilizer for all the plants. There's also this waterfall. It takes in all the rain and it cycles it through. Very nice. It kind of brings nature in. I like how there's a pool in the middle. And I do like the open concept design. Overall, I think it's a really, really nice piece. The first person to be eliminated. I'm sorry, Jazz. You have been eliminated. Michelle. Wait, Michelle's not here. This is no fun. <laughs> Michelle, you're eliminated. Jake, your design looks very, very nice. However, it is not finished. You're eliminated. Mackenzie and Izzy. Jake and Jazz, I'm gonna need a drum roll. The winner is... Izzy! Oh! Thank you, So we will be paying your rent as well as your subscribers' rent. Great job, everyone! We have six artists. Any guesses what we're doing? Painting. Yes. All right, everyone, take a canvas, pass it down. I don't see any... What do you think? Brushes? I don't see any brushes. brushes. Everyone, let me see. I'll give you two options. Small brush or large brush. How, wait, what are the, can we see the large size? Brush. Large brush. Three, Aww. two, one. Small brush. Small. 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 All right. Well, that doesn't matter because you're not going to be using brushes today. Everyone, take off your shoes. <laughs> And your socks. Whoever has the best toe painting after three hours wins up to $5,000 for a subscriber and a little something for yourself. Rules are, you can use any part of your foot. Can I use an opponent's foot? No, you may not. Also, handcuffs. Handcuffs? What? I just want to know, Zach, why you have um, so many pairs of handcuffs handy. Because we have Amazon Prime. I'm not buying it. All right, all right, it was Michelle's idea. Jess, put your arms behind you. Okay, I feel like I'm being arrested. Hey, you guys can still use your phones. You just gotta open it up with your toes. So you can use your hands to move stuff around if you want, but you cannot use it to paint. It's kind of cute. Out of I know. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna get these extra tight. What I did I do this job? Wait, I have an itch in a private area. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. All right, any questions? Are we getting so arrested? So we can use our hands to like pick up paints and open yeah. paints? Yeah, but you have to use your toes to paint. Everyone ready? Yeah. No. Go. Three hours begins now. Guys, and we have a table full of materials on there. You have your palettes, you have your waters, you have markers, whatever you need. Guys, listen up. I'm sure you guys are smart enough to figure out there's also gonna be losing punishments. Oh boy. Oh, no. Anyone that loses has to take a big whiff of Jake's dirty sauce. Because Jake's sock is the nastiest. I've seen it before. What? It's disgusting. I will literally bought it. Jake, if you lose, you have to smell Michelle's sock. Well, I'm not wearing socks. No, Michelle, just show me what her toes look like. <laughs> You'll have to take a big whiff of Michelle's foot. Oh, yeah, I slept for few. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Woo! This is my... Ow! It's quite messy. Well, Michelle, since you're going in so much right now, what's your plan for this? I'm thinking of making a night sky. Well, I'm just gonna put a base coat on right now and I think I'm gonna just do some flowers. I was thinking of making something inspired by Pac-Man, but I'm not 100% sure. So, what are you gonna be painting? I don't know yet, I'm still trying to think of something. You I'm know what you're painting? a tiger. But I might need you to- You and Mackenzie make so many tigers. I'm, I'm gonna do like an ocean background with a <gasps> jellyfish. So usually for challenges, I give you four or eight hours, but today you only have three. So you guys are gonna wanna work fast. So as a group, you guys need to pick one person. Michelle. Mine she. Okay, Michelle. Ben. Are you guys all choosing Michelle? Yeah. Well, it doesn't matter who I, you pick I now guess because so. it doesn't matter. Yeah. All right, as a group, what's the decision? Mitchell. Michelle. All right, I hear Michelle. So Michelle, for the next 30 minutes, you get to paint with your fingers. Yes. So you have 30 minutes, you got to use your fingers. Go finger yeah, that canvas. Yeah. 
Guys, since these are toe paintings and it's a little harder, each of you guys get one more canvas in case you want to restart, but only one. Wait, look at this. <laughs> Besides the fact that my feet are cramping every 10 seconds, I feel like I have a lot down compared to my other competitors. I'm feeling pretty good about this. So right now I'm working on my tiger. I have a lot done so far and all I need to add is the background and finish my final detail. So right now I'm working on my robot. I don't have a lot down right now, so I'm really gonna have to pick it up. I think I'll make it look good. I started a little bit late, obviously. Everybody knows that. But now my canvas looks like this. I got a sky in and some water, and I just got complimented by my competitor, so I'm feeling pretty good. I have a little bit of an advantage. I got to use my fingers for 30 minutes. I might as well use this time to go to the bathroom. I like my piece so far. Right now I'm doing a macaw. I think it's turning out pretty good. I think I've kind of figured out a few tricks to help me paint. All right, everyone close up your legs so I can toss something in your lap. This is a shoelace. No hands at all for this challenge. First person that can manage to tie a knot will win. Go. Wait, is that a fisherman's knot? That's just a normal hat. Like, so no. What's over knot? Okay. I already got one. Can we get confirmation? Is that a fisherman's knot? Is it a double knot? No. That's a figure eight. Good job, babe. What? So here's what's gonna happen. Dip your feet in black paint and step on someone's painting. <gasps> Ken or Jake? She will recover. Ken. Oh. 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 Babe right. is gonna pay for this one. For it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right, good job, babe. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Why are you so aggressive? Oh my god, that can't be. Mackenzie, you always do that. Stop. Mackenzie. Keep your temper Mackenzie. control. Mackenzie, keep your foot to yourself. All right, everyone get back to work. You guys have around an hour and a half left, so you're halfway through. We're gonna do a mini challenge. Winner gets to grab someone to help them for 15 minutes, and the loser has to smell Jake's sock right now. Okay, and it's not just a, it's a. You have 30 seconds to do as many toe prints as possible. Go! With one toe? Yeah, with one toe. One toe at a time. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, toes off your canvas. Everyone, count up how many you have. Jess, how many did you get down? I think 66. I think 70. 78. 58. 59. 40. So, Viv, you said you had 70. Who do you want? 70. Yeah, yes, 78? Yeah. Okay, sorry, Viv. All right, Ben. <laughs> ben, not gonna lie, it looks like you really need the help. All right, who's helping you for the next 15 minutes? Me? What? Jake, you're helping Ben for the next 15 <laughs> minutes. What's up, Jake? I need you to do me another favor. You go grab your sock. Oh, that's... One big whiff. That doesn't stink! What? <laughs> All right, well, I guess the shoe's gonna be the new punishment then. Mackenzie took Jake's sock like a champ. starting again and now I'm doing a beautiful mushroom with my wonderful assistant Jake. So right now I am working on adding the final details of my tiger. I think it has a good chance of life. I was getting pretty nervous slapping all the paint with my feet of how it was turning out but I think the textures look pretty cool. Alright guys add the finishing touches. Five, four, three, two, one. Toes in the air. Alright good job guys. Everyone bring your toe paintings downstairs. Mackenzie tell me about this parrot you painted. So I did a Wait, so you did the background beforehand already, right? Yes. Because I would say this is a nice piece. I just wish the background was like, I don't know, something to make this pop a little bit more because this is like greens and blues and this is all like greens and blues. All right, good job, Mackenzie. I decided to make a tiger because I love tigers. 
They're just curious. How many tigers have you done in these challenges so far? Maybe two. No way! You've done way more than two tigers. Maybe five. Well, I feel like I do see tigers a lot. Nonetheless, very impressive with your toes. Good job, Viv. This is my Neo jellyfish. I went ahead and started with like a gradient background and then I made it really vibrant so it could pop out. And then I used some cool blending techniques to make it look textured and kind of fluffy. Oh, hey, I can still see your toe prints on there. And see each individual toe print. Yeah, it was, it was the textures. <laughs> All right, very nice, Jazz. I got inspiration from the movie Pixels poster, and my painting is Pac-Man eating a city, and this is, oh, I think it's actually San Francisco, because this is the Golden Gate Bridge. <laughs> this is the Golden Gate Bridge, there's some shadowing underneath, and then the city in the background, and a nice sky. That actually turned out pretty nice. I, I think I see it now. I was about to make fun of it, and then I t took a look at it a little bit more, and it actually looks kind of nice. Very nice, Jake. I did a nice guy. I was about to make everything like this. But then I thought it needed more pink, so I added pink. So I made a bioluminescent cherry blossom tree. Misha, I like how you have multiple pinks on here. That's very cool. But, but since when did the flowers grow on like the bottoms no, of the it's trunks? No, it's not growing. It's falling. So they only fall down the trunk. <laughs> <laughs> it's like glowing. All right, good job, Michelle. Some mushroom. There's some grass, a sun, and he has a cute face. About it. Just curious, Ben, did you run out of time? No, actually, Jake helped me out and we finished it super quickly. I pretty much made the top of the mushroom, the spots on the mushroom, the face on the mushroom, and the grass. <laughs> nah. <laughs> ben, so what did you do? What did you do, Ben? I mean, I painted the background, the sun, I painted the stem in, I did the red before Jake did everything else. Good job, Ben. Guys, so how this is gonna work is we're gonna go sudden death. So we're gonna put each painting next to each other. We're gonna go two people at a time and a subscriber's gonna choose which one they wanna keep in. Why don't we do a vote to see who goes against each other first? Ben, vote for someone. Ben. Michelle, vote for someone. Ken. Jake, vote for someone. Viv. <laughs> Jess, vote for someone. Ken. Viv, vote for someone. <laughs> To make this easier, each round I'm gonna think of like a number one through six, then one through five, one through four, and whoever gets those two numbers will be going against each other, okay? Okay. Ben, choose a number. Two, three, five, four. four. Alright, it was one and two. Ben, Michelle, you guys are up. So I asked the first subscriber, which piece do you like better? The mushroom or the night sky? And the person getting eliminated? Ben! What? Yeah, Michelle, you won! Now I'm thinking of a number from one through five. Everyone close their eyes. Mackenzie, choose a number. One, four, two, three, five. It was one and two. So I asked Connor, which one do you like better? The jellyfish or the parrot? Come on, Connor. Don't do me dirty, Don't get Connor. the answer wrong, Connor. He says, this one is a very difficult decision. Oh. But the person getting eliminated, Mackenzie. Oh. Number from one through four, close your eyes. Michelle. Four, three, one. Jeff. This time, the number was two and one. I asked Prod Yuma which one he likes better, the tiger or the jellyfish. The person being eliminated this round, Jazz. Yes! I'm thinking of a number from one through three. Whoever guesses that number automatically makes it into the finale. Two. I was gonna say that. Three. Jake. One. The number was two, which means Viv, you're automatically in the finale. Yes! Jake and Michelle, the person moving on to the finale is... Michelle! <laughs> Alright, get out of here, Jake! I'll be here next week. Wait, I'll be here next week. <laughs> okay, I asked Call Me Lana, which one do you like better? The tiger or the night sky? And the winner of the annual toe painting competition is... Viv! Yeah! Yeah! Good job, man! Michelle, you got so close. You beat out, wait, who did you beat out? You beat out Ben, you beat out Jake, but for this person, it wasn't quite enough to beat out Viv. Michelle, nice try, nice try. Jake, prepare your shoe, and Viv, come with me. Yay! Everybody that lost, I mean, including myself, had to smell my sock. And for me, I'm gonna have to smell Michelle's foot. Who wants to go first? No, we can smell go. Yeah, this is fun. <laughs> Kenzie, that was it. No, it's good enough. No, it wasn't. You, you take a big whiff of this. Michelle, closer. No, that's my nose. You gotta get into the toe. Oh, you gotta get in the toe. Look. Oh. 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 Oh
so right now you're gonna win some money for your subscriber. You're gonna run one mile. If you get 9.59, that's $1,000. If you get 8.59, that's 2,000. 7.59, that's 3,000. 6.59, that's 4,000. 5.59, that's 5,000. And if, if you go under, which I think will be really hard, you'll get more. The faster you run, the more money your subscriber will win. Ready, set, go. Go, Viv, go! We have five artists and five canvases. You guys will each have two hours to make a painting. The best one will have a chance to win up to $5,000. But... Uh. Everyone, lift up your index finger. <laughs> that is the only thing you can paint with, nothing else. All right, two hours begins now. Also, if you guys want to mix paint, you guys have to use your fingers. Gonna go grab some paint. Let's grab some paint. <laughs> Ooh, this, this stuff is liquidy. I'm gonna kind of go for like oh, earth that's like a crescent. I think I'm gonna do some sort of pink sunset. So the top of the sky is a little bit purple and bluish. I'm gonna mix it together. A lot of fun doing this. It reminds me of kindergarten. So for five thousand is on the line, Michelle. True. This is pretty fun. Right now, I got my eyes on Viv and Ben. They're really focusing on their painting. It looks like they already know what they're doing. Jazz, if she wants to take the dub, she's really gonna have to be confident and just go for it. For Michelle, she's the underdog over here. Johnny's will be interesting because he doesn't usually paint. Michelle's about to tap out. I will at least finish this one. Everyone, we have an hour and 30 minutes left. Jess, what are you painting? I'm painting the night sky. Ben, what are you painting right now? I am doing like an outer space theme. Viv, what are you working on? Sunset. Johnny. I'm working on turkey and scrunchie. Michelle? I'm doing a pink sunset. All right, everyone, keep it up. Almost done with my base. Now I'm gonna go in and draw the clouds. Dude, you're spilling all. Down. So I finished the black and the earth is mainly done. Halt, sit. We're at the one hour mark. Ben and Viv are still going very strong. I'm actually surprised how well Michelle's doing. Jazz's is looking a little bit messy. For Johnny, it's looking really, really good. Dan, do you have any opinion on who is the best right now? I think Ben's is the best. But it might not be the best after this challenge. This will be pretty intense. I just added another planet and a galaxy. I might add another one, but I might do the stars first. We are halfway through the challenge, which means we have a mini challenge. I have 16 slips of paper in here. Five of them have each one of your names. If someone picks your name, they have 10 seconds to use their finger, dip it in paint, and mess up as much of your painting as they can. If you grab a blank one, that means you don't do anything and it's the next person's turn. However, if you grab your own name, you get to do it to everyone but your own. Sound good? Pick one. Oh, it's blank. Choose. Oh! Ben, dip your finger somewhere. <laughs> Ten, nine, nine eight, 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 six, five, five four, four, three, three two, two, one. Right, Ben? <laughs> oh, a blank card, which means you don't get to mess anyone's up. <laughs> no! oh! All right. Ten, nine, eight, eight seven, seven oh six, gosh. five, four, three, two. One. It actually looks like you helped her paint some clouds. <laughs> I was blank. Oh, oh I was blank. <laughs> I was gonna give the name I picked a thousand dollars. I have to fix it now. I was basically done already. I'm actually pretty happy that Johnny didn't mess it up. Thank you, Johnny. I feel so bad. Look at this. Holy sh I was planning on doing an outline, but I really don't like it, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Added some asteroids, another planet. 
So far, the two people slightly lagging behind are Jazz and Michelle. Jazz's is kind of chunky. She has her own style where it's kind of paint right on the canvas. Michelle's, although hers is good, Michelle still has a lot of stuff to work on. Right now, Viv is doing a gold border on her painting, which is really cool. Ben's space design is insane. And then Johnny, he got the most even gradients I've ever seen on a painting. For the last 15 minutes, we're gonna have a challenge that's about to change everything. We're gonna draw names again. This time, we'll put more pieces of paper. However, if anyone draws a piece of paper that says elimination, they get to choose someone from the five and eliminate them from the contest, which means they cannot compete anymore and they are out. That's f up. <laughs> so I think that I'm all done with mine. I just finished. I got the world down here, and I got a purple planet, red planet, I have stars everywhere. I think I'm gonna add a constellation. Something to jazz it up. You get it? My name is Jazz. If you choose a card that says eliminate, you choose one of your competitors and kick them off the challenge, which means <laughs> they don't have a chance to win the 5,000. Michelle? <laughs> Blank? <laughs> Okay. I'm sorry, you are out. Close your eyes, Ben. All right. Oh! Ben, you get to eliminate one contestant. I think we have to go with Jazz, sadly. All right, Jazz, shake your competitor's hand. You are officially eliminated from the challenge. <laughs> you guys are officially out. We have three contestants left, and we have 15 minutes on the clock. One of you guys are gonna be the winner. So I'm gonna try and add some details onto the balloon and then I'm done 30 seconds left oh my God. Three, two, one, hands in the air <laughs> Us three are gonna be judging. We're just gonna choose our favorite one. It's like a galaxy thing So I really like how you blended it. I think it was really smart that you use your fingers to flick the paint as stars I love how it looks like there's depth. I really like this purple color and the ring that goes with it. <laughs> Great job there. I love sunsets and the beach. I would hang that in my room. It's beautiful. Aww. The sunset looks really realistic. Good job, babe. So I also did a pink sunset. That's really cute. Michelle, when did you start painting? Never. <laughs> Seeing your art from before, this is a very big blow up. <laughs> Thank you. Brandon and Dan, we're gonna have to go make our decision. They're all extremely good. I agree. Definitely. I Go with. I was gonna go with Viv. Dan. I was also gonna go with Ben. Well, it looks like it's Ben then. Right. You all did very, very well. However, we can only have one winner. Viv, unfortunately, <laughs> what? you're gonna have to say goodbye to Michelle oh. because she is not a good person. I'm excited. Down to the final two. And the winner is Ben. Oh. Ben painted this with his finger. Viv, yours was really good, no doubt. You are the winner. Which means you gotta play me a rock, paper, scissors. You get a thousand dollars each time you beat me. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh! That's one thousand dollars for that. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. That's also not a victory. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh. You have one more try to win another thousand dollars. Rock, paper, okay, I'll just let you win this one. <laughs> Ben gets $2,000! Yeah. I honestly didn't think I was gonna win. I thought Vivian was gonna win. It's super realistic. <laughs> I told you. Uh, I know, I'm excited for Dan. <laughs> Every time someone watching this video subscribes, I will give you a penny. If 1 million people subscribe because of this video, you get 10,000. 10 million people subscribe, you get 100,000. But to determine the winner, you guys will need to do a painting challenge. Lift up your paintbrush. Throw it to the side. <laughs> We are painting with our fingers. Again, the best one will win all the money for every time someone subscribes. The losers will get ice dumped on their head. You have four hours, time starts now. Viv, I know you're very good at finger painting and surprisingly, you have not won a single challenge yet. This might be the one though. So it's gonna change today? I'm hoping it will. So far, Mackenzie's won the most out of anyone here. Guys, this means that if someone needs to get punished, we know who we're going for, right? <laughs> Okay, wait, one question. Why isn't anyone starting? All right, first person to get any paint on the canvas will win something. Okay. All right, Viv, since you were the first one to put paint on the canvas, choose one person and they need to paint with their toe for an hour. Babe, I jumped in the pool for you. Oh my God, this is so cold. 
Viv, you're safe this time because Mackenzie jumped in I'm for you. Crazy. Viv, it can be anyone. Who is it? I'm picking Kenzie. <laughs> oh! Kenzie, you just got stabbed in the back by Viv. Mackenzie, for the first hour, you have to paint with your big toe. Yeah. This is what you get out of jumping in the pool. <laughs> Jake, what's the plan? I am making a finger-themed creature mm. because we are finger painted. I'm gonna paint some sneakers, specifically some mochas. I'm gonna draw some colorful elephants. Keep in mind, you haven't won one yet. Imagine this, if you want all of them, you probably would have like 200,000 right now. That would have been great. But maybe this one? I'm painting a nice scenery. Again, this is my second time finger painting. This was Michelle's painting the first time, and I guess we can compare them and see if they're better. Well, if you want to know the quickest way to get a foot cramp, this is it. All right, well, good luck, everyone. We're around half an hour in. <laughs> Got my handy dandy reference. This is my own hand, by the way. Well, I can't move because I have paint on my foot that is wet. Viv, since you <laughs> oh so gratefully blessed me with this challenge, I'm gonna need white paint and that little like, periwinkle color. There you go. It's been one hour, Mackenzie. You can start using your finger again. That is a really nice background, though. Ooh, all right, that's looking pretty good. Really? Kind of, yeah. It's not too bad. These rainbow elephants are looking pretty nice. Did you get inspiration from that rainbow elephant right yeah, there? Yeah, I saw it and I couldn't think of anything. <laughs> this is just going to be like a chippy background to make that pop. It's a finger-themed creature. These are going to be hands as wings. The hair is going to be fingers. The legs are going to be fingers. And obviously, I'm going to clothe my finger creature. Guys, we have a challenge. It is a very simple game of rock, paper, scissors. If you lose, you get ice water dumped on your head. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. You're safe. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Michelle is safe. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh! So it looks like Jazz gets some ice water. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh wait. <laughs> no, that's a rock. You get ice water. Guys, this is why you don't lose in rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> Jake, we're not finished. What? That's all we have? <laughs> Are we done now? Yeah, we're done. <laughs> Jazz and Jake, don't lose next time. All right, so we're about an hour and a half in. I'm honestly surprised Mackenzie's doing so well, considering she had to paint with her toes. We'll have to see how well she paints with her finger, but it's looking really, really nice. Michelle's is doing okay. She has this turquoise road, and then she's trying to draw a couple trees. This is looking really, really nice. She took inspiration from a rainbow elephant. I think she's gonna do well. Jazz has some sneakers painted. It looks a little bit empty, but if she works on the background, she might be able to make a top two finish. I feel like Jake's is gonna end up being a wild card. It's really, really strange, but it looks kind of good. We still have around two and a half hours left. We have another mini challenge. You'll have a chance to win some money. Everyone pull out your phone, go onto YouTube. So we have a new channel called ZHC Shorts. I'm gonna go check to see who subscribed to it. Mackenzie is not subscribed to ZHC Shorts. Michelle is not subscribed. Michelle, you're the one who created it with me. How are you not subscribed? Viv is subscribed to ZHC Shorts. Are you subscribed though? I just found out ZHC Shorts was a thing, so. Okay, <laughs> you already know I'm subscribed, come on. Jake, you subscribed to the wrong one. <laughs> Jake did have the right intentions, but unfortunately he subscribed to the fake ZHC Shorts. <laughs> I was gonna give everyone who subscribed to it $100, but since literally nobody else subscribed but you, you'll get everyone's money. You get 500. So moral of the story, subscribe. <laughs> In this tray, we have seven slips of paper. One of you guys could get eliminated right now. So you pretty much do whatever is on the paper. Add to a painting. Mackenzie, are you gonna get revenge? Oh! oh. oh. Your yeah. turn to choose. Help someone with an egg. I might have to go with Jake. No. Oh. <laughs> This is getting a little intense. I have to sit out for 30 minutes. Pour ice on competitor. Yeah, I chose Michelle. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, Jess, it's been 30 minutes. You can keep painting. So the artists have around 45 minutes left and it's time to give them another challenge. What's gonna happen right now is as a team, you will pick one person. That person will either get a punishment or they might get a little advantage. Oh, you guys vote and decide. Oh. All right, Jake. Jake. 
Yeah, Jake. I vote Jake too. I vote for Jaslyn. So four votes Jake, <laughs> one vote Jazz, which means Jake, you're gonna take a paper towel, you're gonna drench it in paint, and throw it at whichever painting oh. you want. Go ahead and drench this in paint. Just wait, wait. Oh, no. multiple colors. Whenever you're ready, Jake. One chance and you missed. Not gonna lie, the damage isn't that bad. All right, Jake, how do you think you're doing so far? I have the most original art piece here, but I'm gonna really have a hard time trying to outline these fingers. Who do you think is taking the dub? I think that <laughs> Viv is taking the dub. Viv, who do you think is winning? Either Ken's or maybe me, but I don't think that's an option. <laughs> if I gotta say, Mackenzie or Viv. I think Viv. Jake's is also pretty good. You have 35 minutes left. <laughs> and we still have one more chance. Artist, pick a person. Uh, Michelle. They get the one with me for now. Michelle. Jazz. Jake. Ironically, Michelle is the one with the most followers and subscribers on YouTube. So, yeah, subscribe to Michelle's YouTube channel. Follow okay. her on Instagram. Michelle, I'll give you $100 to give to a random person. Oh, that's, okay. That's that right okay. Go wash your hands and then hold up your painting. So my painting is of an alligator. I like the trees over here. It looks really interesting how the alligator is submerged underwater. You can clearly see that this part's underwater and then it gets darker on top. It's a, it's a self portrait of me. I'm in a bunch of pink trees. Very cute. The trees are nice. You could have cleaned it up down here a little bit. It looks a little messy. Overall, I'd say good improvement. Well, I got inspiration <laughs> from the elephant over there. It looks a little lonely, so I made two baby elephants. Ooh, not gonna lie, I really like the tusks. I do like the color and the contrast with the background. It really makes everything pop, so yeah, good job. We have a very colorful, vibrant, beautiful, bodacious background. And then we have some legs floating out of the sky over there. I created a finger-themed creature. <laughs> it looks very interesting. Comment what you think. So I am gonna eliminate one person at a time until we have two left. Then I'm gonna let my subscribers choose which one they like the best. I love all of these paintings. I would personally hang all of them up. Unfortunately, four are gonna be losers. Yeah. Jess, so. unfortunately, you've been eliminated. I'm so sorry. Okay. Michelle. Yeah. Incredible, Michelle. I love it. Now, with that being said, you've been eliminated. <laughs> Viv, say goodbye to Jake because Jake... <laughs> Jake. I just had to mess around with you guys a little bit. <laughs> so now it gets interesting. Viv, you've won zero challenges. Yep. Mackenzie, you've won more than anyone here. You've won three challenges. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a picture of them. The voting has begun. <laughs> Mackenzie, if you do end up winning this challenge, what are you gonna do with the money? To my family or for a car so I don't have to keep walking. The results are in. Remember, whoever wins gets a penny for every single person that subscribes because of this video. Three, two, one! <laughs> the final result was 57% Viv, 43% Mackenzie. Viv will get a penny every time someone subscribes because of this video. This deal is for life. So in 20 years, if 10 million people subscribe because of this video, you get $100,000. Oh, Viv! Oh, Viv! And what did you say you were going to use this money for? I'm going to get a card and I'm going to save it for all right, good job. Hey, Viv, what I'm gonna have you do is you're gonna be the one that pours the ice on everyone else. Michelle, Jazz, Jake, get outside. I'm one, sorry, Michelle, go. I love you. <laughs> oh, I love you. I love you. I hate you, Viv.